Most people know me as Gabriel Wilson, but I was actually born a McGuire. Gabriel Solomon McGuire. My parents separated when I was two years old, and um, I really don't have many memories of my dad at all from when I was a kid, maybe two or three. So they packed their bags and they moved out east to the Tulsa drought From the rain and the Oregon trees Trying to get it right And they got pregnant with two or three But then they lost them all with the stress that a new job brings And then they had me When I was 18, I got really curious and I wanted to, I wanted to meet my dad wanted to know what he was like. And so I got in touch with him. And um, ever since then, we've been slowly building a relationship. I got a text from my dad, kind of out of the blue. I hadn't really heard from him in a while. And in his text, he told me that my grandpa McGuire, his dad, had passed away. I didn't really know my grandpa McGuire at all. This stung. Jesus was my dad Oh, but I was cool with that I traveled to Tulsa to go to my grandfather's memorial service. My eyes were open to this whole world of McGuire that I had never really known. And through his passing, I became absolutely in awe of his legacy. He was a husband and a father, grandfather, even a great, great grandfather. He was a preacher and a musician and a songwriter and a really, really good man. All of my life I had grown up a Wilson, but there had never been anything of McGuire as I grew up as a boy that I, I knew except the pain and sting of divorce. And for the first time in my life, I was proud to be a McGuire. So hold your head up, 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 hold your head up. I always process my emotions and my thoughts through the songs that I write. So I started writing songs. I wrote songs about the sting of divorce, about the courage that my mom had, about the conversations that my dad and I have had as we've gotten to know each other where he's given me profound advice. I even recorded two of my grandfather McGuire's songs just because I wanted to pay tribute to his legacy as a songwriter. I even recorded a song of my dad's just to make him proud. There was the story that I had to tell about reconciliation and about redemption, about the legacy of my grandfather. I had been walking out without ever having known him. I'm a Wilson, but I was born a McGuire. And these things that I've given my life to, ministry and songwriting and being a rebel, <laughs> it came from the McGuire side. Mm -hmm.